With the hardware configuration open, double click the CPU. The first tab of CPU properties is the general tab. In the short description field, you will find the amount of high speed or work memory, the time it takes to execute 1000 instructions, and information about communication protocol and interfaces. Whether multi-tier configuration and routing is supported, and the CPU's offline catalog firmware version are also shown. Here you give the CPU its name that is identified in the project structure and also downloads to the CPU. The optional plant designation field identifies parts of the plant according to their functions and conforms to the IEC 1346-1 standard. The optional local designation field identifies a measuring point or group of measuring points within a system, similar to identifying a street on a map. The IDs entered in either of these fields can be evaluated in the user program. Click the Help button for more information and a sample program. Click the Comment field. In the Comments field, you can enter a note that displays in the Hardware Configuration window. Click OK to close the CPU properties. The CPU comment shows in the Details window comment field next to the CPU. Keep in mind that if CPU parameters are changed, the hardware configuration must be downloaded again. The other tabs of CPU properties are discussed in separate videos. This concludes the video on 